you guys. Um, so today we are going to be doing a, another unboxing. Why are we doing another unboxing? Because I don't have anything to review. We have nothing, absolutely nothing to review. It's I mean, kind of sad. I but... could come up with something to review, but it would kind of be, it would be weak. It would be weak. And what would you review? I don't know. I have a shiny phone case. No, I don't know. But thankfully we do have something that was delivered to us this weekend, March 18th. I'm pretty sure that's right because March, I think it's St. Patrick's Day on sure. Saturday. March 18th is the New York City Half Marathon. I will be participating. This guy right here. Participating it. I just feel like if I say I'm running it, it makes it seem like I'm fast. Or that you're like a, a organizer who's helping put it on. Like if I say participating? No, if you say you're running it. Oh, I never <laughs> thought about that. Right, right. Eric is not actually coordinating the event. No. He will be participating, participating. in it by running in it. Sure, I will be moving my legs at some speed, whether that be walking, crawling, or running. I think this, uh, you can like, you're like Flash. You can go really fast. He's really fast, You guys. know what? You know what? If you close your eyes, I'm like the fastest person in the world. You just can't, you can't see me because then it just messes up my superpowers. Oh, wow. Yeah. Well, then I hope New York... And everybody watching closes their eyes. It's kind of like hurt. it's kind of like that movie with Ben Stiller, Mystery Men. Mm -hmm. That one character who can turn invisible, but, but he can't, can't do it when you're looking, looking at, him. at him. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All, All right. right. Let's open this up and see what we have inside. I hope there's some good stuff. Well, we'll see. They changed the whole box. It used to have like oh. like stuff on the outside. Right now it now it's just a plain white box. Plain white box. Does no. that mean there's better stuff inside now? Mm, We're gonna find. Let's out. find out. All right. First, I see some stuff in there. This stuff in here. First thing. Uh oh, that is sunscreen. It looks like sunscreen. Well, not to me. Oh, okay. I thought this was an energy drink. Oh no. It's Surface Sun System Dry Touch Quick Dry Sunscreen Spray. But wait, That's a can, lot of words. To if you quickly, sunscreen. if I quickly showed this to you, would no, you be like, no. "Oh, it's like a lime energy drink"? I'll try this. No, because of the top. What do you? Who looks at the top when you get something? I'm, it helps you identify what it is. I look at the whole thing when really? I get it. Really? Yes, I don't just like. Oh, it's gray and green. It must be lime. Total, total energy drink. I would. He's weird. I would try this. Uh, so it is SPF <laughs> plus 50. What does that mean? I mean, 50 plus. It means the... Is 50 plus 51? Probably. 55? 50.1. 50.1. Uh, water resistant for up to 80 minutes. That means you can sweat for almost an hour and a half before it comes off. Uh, UVA, UVVB, continuous spray, sunscreen. It is paraben free and hypoallergenic. I will probably need this in May. And it's lime flavored. It's not flavored. It's sunscreen. <laughs> Please don't eat sunscreen. Please don't try to eat sunscreen. Does it say light fragrance? Uh, yeah, light fragrance. Okay. Maybe you, that doesn't mean you can. But eat what? It. What does it smell like? Maybe it smells like lime. Do you want to smell it? I'll spray it, smell it on you. No, I don't spray it on you. Okay, me. exactly. I feel like it's still lime. Uh, next thing up, we have K Kine tape. Kinesiology tape. Is that how you pronounce it? I think so. I okay. hope so. K tape. So it says on the. Okay. You have used this before. You used this in what race? There was a race. I remember I taped you up before you left. It was really, really early in the morning. I remember posting that picture. Yeah. And people were horrified because they said it was too much leg. Because I think I. It was a lot of leg. It was like it an was upper like thigh. It was like. A, so Eric heard his IT band at one point, and so we got some K, K tape to try to fix it. Um, I look at this and all I see is this picture of somebody's knee and I, that's my knee. I need this for my knee. So, so far we've gotten two things that are for me and there's nothing <laughs> yeah. for you. So I mean, far. I don't understand how your knee hurts. I mean, I understand how your my knee hurts. My knee hurts when I run. Because it's new. No, it's because my knee is hurts. It's not because it, running is new. It's because you know when you, I'm old now. You know when you lift, I'm an old You know person. when you lift weights and it's yeah. like the first time you're like, oh, wait a minute. No, no, no. Carrying groceries hurt. It, it's it's really, not a muscle pain. I feel like it's a muscle pain. I don't think your knee is like dislocated. But we'll see. I'm not a doctor. I just play one on the internet. The next thing we have. Baby food. Babies. <laughs> Baby food. Or it could be sunscreen. We're not quite sure. <laughs> it all depends on what the top <laughs> is. Top looks like. And this screams baby food. It definitely screams baby food. 
Uh, so let's see what this one is. This is blueberry and beet, and I see another baby food in there, so why don't you get it out? This is Noka Superfood Blend with Mackie Berry, Banana, Apple, Lemon. Mackie Berry? Is that how you say that? I don't know. I feel like I would say Maki. Okay, Maki. I don't know. I don't know. I had a friend I'm in high school English lit who had major. a Q-U-E on the end of her name, and her name was Jackie, and we called her Jackie because we thought it was funny, but I don't think that, I don't think it's Maqui. You know, that, that sounds like bullying right now. Oh, it's not though, because she thought it was fun. No, I'm pretty sure on today's oh. standards, that's bullying. Sounds like you were an awful bullying we, child. We didn't bully her about it. It was like a nickname. I don't think. And she was like, ha ha, and then went home and cried. That's not true. <laughs> we went to boarding school together. She didn't go home. She went to her room and cried. Because everyone okay, made fun of her name. Not the point, not the point. Uh, <laughs> So this is organic, non-GMO, vegan, gluten-free. This sounds awful. It's probably, probably awful. You can uh, try it. Refrigerate after opening and consume within 24 hours. I imagine if you open one of these, you probably should just eat it or throw it away. You probably shouldn't put it in the refrigerator. Right. So this is mango and coconut, but what's confusing to me, it also says camu, camu? Camu, camu. Camu, banana, apple, lemons, with brown rice protein and flaxseed. Flaxseed is supposed to be really good for you. It apparently is. Apparently I need more flaxseed in my life. Okay, well then you can eat these. I'll put them in the refrigerator so they're cold beforehand. They yeah. probably taste less terrible when they're cold. Well, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna be the taste tester. Okay. Um, here we go. Ooh, gummies, energy chews. Is this scratch? Yeah, we've gotten stuff from them. Really? Mm-hmm. Okay. We have, we have, um, granola bars in the other room and something else I'm not remembering what flavor okay. do you have there these are orange I don't want orange can I trade what do I have I have raspberry I can I have raspberry why do you want raspberry I don't like orange why don't you like orange I don't really like citrus you were literally eating an orange today at work it's because I'm trying this new thing where I'm trying to eat more citrus because I know fruit is good for me especially if it's like real fruit but I don't really like oranges. What's a real fruit? Like apple's not a real fruit? No, apple is definitely a real fruit. I mean like... What's a fake fruit? I don't know. Fruit I don't know why I said that. I would agree that fruit roll-ups are a fake fruit. I don't know why I said that. I don't know why. I don't know what I was going for there. <laughs> I want to eat point? real fruit unlike dark chocolate. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Dark chocolate with fruit in it is not real fruit. Well, like that chocolate orange thing, which I've never had, but I... I, I I've never had a chocolate but orange. But you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, chocolate orange. Oh, yeah, I've never had that. Anyway, uh, you can have the orange. Wait, you just said you need to eat more citrus. <laughs> I didn't say I need to. I said I was trying to. It doesn't mean that I want fruit juice. This These can... are not real fruit. This is not real fruit. Actually, actually, can it you says, read what it, it says? It says flavored with real fruit. That is not real fruit, by the way. The main ingredients are sugar and tapioca syrup. Just saying. Yeah, I don't see any. Oh no, there is. Oh, there's raspberry powder. Yeah. But it's supposed to be good for you. It's gluten free, dairy free, and vegetarian. It's very uh, PC. Are there non vegetarian gummies? What would they put in there? They make it non vegetarian. Uh. Like bacon fat. I. Uh, some gelatins are made out of animals. I don't think I knew that. Yeah. Like Jello is no. made out of animals. No, not anymore. It used to be. Yeah. I didn't I didn't I didn't I we can have a discussion later. I didn't have much Jello growing up. We can discuss gelatin. Uh, gelatin the next thing later. we have, the last thing we have in this box. They're little chocolate. Little chocolate thingies. What is Good yours? Good day chocolate. Good day chocolate. Uh, mine says, "Is it spicy in here?" This dark chocolate and turmeric blend begs to differ. Oh, okay. yours says it in the back. Yeah. Mine just says, "Good day chocolate." Be moody. That's all. I Mine it says turmeric or turmeric, depending on how you say it. Turmeric. So it has a, an R in it. I've always said turmeric, but I feel like it's turmeric. has an R in it. Well, the it's English like language, it. I think, it's is one of the most difficult languages in the world to learn. Uh, okay. I could like make that up. I like dark chocolate a lot, so I would. Is it just chocolate with the flavor of turmeric? Yeah. Mine is mine is chocolate with the flavor of probiotic. Okay. What does probiotic taste like? Probably like chocolate. That is, that's weird. It's a dietary supplement. I, I'm, that, that, I would not, I'm on a diet and I'm just gonna eat this. No, 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 I don't. It's a supplement to your diet, not in lieu of your food that you're eating. Words are hard I'm sometimes. Just eating. How much probiotic do you need? Two, nice and easy. Four, which is one serving right as rain. Six, 
tip top tummy eight good gut feeling because probiotics are good for your digestive system eight of them no there's they then on the back i think it also says how many you should have per serving and then how much you shouldn't exceed per day this says four pieces per serving do not exceed more than two boxes daily consumed several hours apart they want you to take your time those are going to be for you i'll eat them i know i'll that, try them at least along with your orange flavored uh gummies and your i don't you can have the you can have the baby food it's not baby food it comes in a pouch like how baby food comes you know baby food comes like this now you know, Capri Sun kind of comes like that, but without the top. But they don't have it. Again, it all comes back to what the top looks like. Anyway, uh, so that was what was in the box today. Um, wish this guy luck in running the uh, New York City Half Marathon. This Motivate Sunday. this one to start running because she has hey, the Brooklyn I've Half Marathon. I ran four miles this past weekend, and this coming weekend I will run five. Yes, so she could use all the encouragement and well-wishing from you guys out there. So every now and then, just comment, hey Emma, you should be running. Or hey Emma, glad to hear you're running. Or hey Emma, stop reading this comment and go for a run. All that is like, it's good motivation. I have no words. Keeps you going. Uh-huh. All right guys. Okay. That is gonna be it. She's gonna, as soon as this is done, she's gonna go for a run. Super proud of you. No. Good job. No. Really hope you had a great day. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, support us on Patreon and give this one some motivation. And until then, we'll talk to you next time. Bye guys.